When you go, I was here, but this year is different. I'm going to close the year 2017 with a big win. I love Kansas. I mean, every time that they say it's a fight, I like to, come to fight in Kansas. It feels like home right now because uh, not just come here to fight, but when I come here to help other fighters, all my other friends from Brazil. So I make Kansas City like my, my little home. I like it. So the fruit I'm getting for after weigh-ins is quite gay. Uh, I have all my meals prepped for today and tomorrow. And then post weigh-ins is going to be eating out and then snacking on stuff. So I got to get stuff to snack on throughout the day, stuff to rehydrate too. Uh, it's been really good actually. I started working with the nutritionist this time around, so everything's just worked out for me. Um, I'm a lot leaner this time and uh, started uh, water loading a little earlier, so I'm lighter sooner. So I think that the hardest part, which is the night before in the morning of, is going to be a whole lot easier than it has been before. And my energy level is great, so I'm actually really excited to see how it's going to turn out at the end. So. Uh, I think Friday night is going to be uh, it's going to be easy money. I don't know. I think I feel good. Uh, I feel more aggressive. I feel like uh, you know mentally, Amber's having a hard time trying to come off this losing streak. Um, for me, I had a great camp. I feel great. Uh, I feel ready to impose my game plan. So you know, I'm hoping that uh, instead of fight of the night this time, that it's going to be performance of the night. So. seconds. Uh, the change in camps has been amazing for Amber. Um, she started with us um, early this year um, and has been just dedicated. Her game's completely evolved uh, as far as her, her wrestling, her jiu-jitsu, her fence work, her striking. Um, I think that everybody's going to be really surprised at the new Amber Brown that's going to come out um, on Friday night. This year, uh, well, it's been okay. You know, I lost my only fight I had this year so far, but I've been just training a lot. You know, I took kind of nine months off, but I was okay with that because I've just been learning a lot, trying to evolve my game, coming off three losses. You know, I needed to make a little changes, you know, so it's been good. I've been learning, trying to just evolve and train, train as much as I can and just get better every day. I'm going to win Friday. I'm going to go out there and get my hand raised. I'm going to fight my butt off. You know, I'm going to do whatever I, it takes to come out with the win. Uh, my job for this fight week is just to help her stay relaxed, uh, get the weight off. You know, obviously that's a big one for Mackenzie. Uh, but get the weight off, uh, help her stay relaxed uh, in, in the right frame of mind. And she's such an experienced uh, competitor. I think, you know, she does a, a good job of that. So my job is just mostly to help get the weight off. And, um, you know, that's the hard part, really. I, I think Mackenzie's been working hard on her stand-up. Uh, we all know how uh, great, you know, a multiple-time world champion jiu-jitsu person is. So their ground is is pretty home, you know. Uh, you have to branch out. You have to go to your uncomfortable zone. And that's the striking for her. And you saw in her last fight getting a, a big knockdown. Uh, her hands are progressing. Her stand-up is progressing. And that's where we've been concentrating on a lot uh, with our head stand-up coach, uh, Eddie Cha. And so uh, I think this fight is just about that, letting her hands go, letting her stand-up go, letting her feel more comfortable in the stand-up realm. You know, I really don't know. Like, for sure, I want to work, like, my stand-up, you know. Again, like, jiu-jitsu is always going to be my instincts, you know. So anytime I can, uh, I would like to finish the fight and, uh, you know, I think like standing up, you're like even if I'm winning the whole fight, if she gets one punch, like the right spot, the right time, everything, it can be over, you know? So of course I don't want to be like risking myself, uh, you know, on someone else's game, you know, when my game is a ground throw, you know? She'll be surprised by my striking, you know, just because maybe like by my strength or something, you know, because I'm a, everyone knows me as a jiu-jitsu girl, you know, so when they see like, I know a little bit, you know, not that I'm like really, really good at stand-up, you know, but I think they, it's always a little bit surprising when they feel it. 
Um, but I've seen like a little bit of her and I know that she like punches hard and she's like very great. She seems like such a tough girl, you know, like just like kind of going forward and like resisting everything. So I know it'll be a really good fight and uh, definitely I'm excited.